Today, I'm going to show you how to set up Grafana to display log metrics from Logzine. Before I dive into the how-to steps, let me first show you the data source settings. First, I'm going to set the type as Elasticsearch. Second, I'm going to the HTTP settings section, and I'm going to enter the Logzine receiver URL using HTTPS. Then, here at the Axis field, I'm going to select Proxy. Next, I'm going to drop down to the Elasticsearch Details section, where we have perhaps the most important part of the settings, the index pattern, where we use the Logzine token, together with the daily index pattern. And that's it for the data source settings. Now, let's move on to the dashboard. The first thing I'm going to do is click on Dashboards over here in the upper left, and that is going to pull up a new dashboard that I've prepared. Now, I'm going to show you the new settings for the text display in the table. First, I'm going to this metric section and I'm going to select raw document from the pull down menu. After that, I'm going to go up to the options tab, which will change this section of the screen. From here, I'm going to go over to the two table transform field and choose JSON data. Then I'm going to go directly under that to the columns field and enter the field names that I need. As you can see, I've already got mine in here, size, path, and method. Finally, let's go back to the dashboard, and now we can see that Grafana is showing logs and metrics from Logzine. And that's all there is to it. Thank you.